friends and family and good morning from Disney's Hollywood Studios. I thought it'd be fun to come out today, head over to Hollywood Studios, check out all of the newest merchandise that Walt Disney World has to offer. Pretty recently the Hollywood Tower Hotel came out with an entire new collection. I'm really excited to head over there and also Halloween time and spooky season is right around the corner and Walt Disney World is putting out so much awesome new merchandise. I'm excited to do the full tour here at Disney's Hollywood Studios. But before we get started, if you would subscribe and click the bell notification so you're aware of future uploads and live streams, we would greatly appreciate it. Right now it is officially 9 a.m. and Disney's Hollywood Studios does open at 9. So we are officially rope dropping Hollywood Studios. That being said, it looks like a really nice day outside. Very overcast, even a breeze, which is really nice to have here and a nice July day at Walt Disney World. And before we do head inside Hollywood Studios, I do want to mention if there is any merchandise in today's video that you are interested in, definitely check out the shopping tier of our Patreon page. I'll let a link to that in the description box. Is there more than I can? Yeah, you're good. You're good. And now that we've officially made our way inside of Disney's Hollywood Studios, look at the incredible views here on Hollywood Boulevard. You got Mickey and Minnie's Runaway Railway right down there in the distance. But I do want to head over to Mickey's of Hollywood. Always my favorite shop to check out some merchandise as soon as you come inside the park. So as soon as you come inside, they have a great assortment of different ears like the solid black sequins with the ruby red bow. That is a really fun pair. These really sparkle in the Florida sunshine. Right up ahead is a pair. These are actual uh, Disney Park lounge flies. It has the badge on the side, this woven basket material. Those are $45. Kind of continuing with the uh, black sequins. They do have this one here with the uh, red polka dots. It looks really nice with the red on the inside. Let's see what else we can find over in this section. So these are all $35. They do have the soft pink ears with the sequins, the oversized bow. But here's a really fun pair. These are uh, two different colored sequins with the shiny sequins, I should say. And then you have Minnie Mouse's uh, white polka dots there with the sequins. And right underneath there, how about this pair with all like the different multi-color. You even get the princess tiara with all that pearl design. And they do still have a lot of your 2024 Disney Parks merchandise here at Hollywood Studios as well. Here's that fancy button-down shirt with Mickey, Cinderella Castle, the Genie's Lamp, some teacups. This has everything. Those are $65 a piece. Right over here is the perfect side bag. I love these. Very good size for the theme parks. Lots of different zipper compartments. Again, you have like Figment, Dumbo the Flying Elephant, even the original Florida Orange Bird. Those are $40 a piece. And then right underneath there is the matching adult size baseball cap. All of this is embroidered on the front though with the characters and all four beacons of magic for $30. And perfect for the warmer Florida weather. They do still have the tank tops with that really fun design. Very retro too with like the neon colors. It has the sparkly 2024 with Cinderella Castle. Those are $35. And if you are looking for a really fun uh, graphic t-shirt commemorating your trip here to Walt Disney World in 2024, this one's awesome for $35. In this section here, they also have a good selection of your shoulder plushies. This one is perfect for uh, Disney's Hollywood Studios, one of my favorite shows, the Beauty and the Beast one. You have Chip. This is the little magnetic shoulder plushie. Those are $22.99. Right underneath Chip, you do have this one here from Mickey and Minnie's Runaway Railway. It comes with the little uh, magnetic attachment on the bottom, $22.99 for him. And then right underneath there, they do also have some... Um, Grogu ones. This one's a little bit more expensive at $30, but I do believe that he uh, lights up. Let's see what we got doing here. Yep, he lights up for $30. And right underneath there, last but not least, they do have some really adorable uh, Groot shoulder plushies for $23. 
It looks like they do also have some of your 90th anniversary of Donald Duck merchandise. Really cool to see some of the different like lounge fly bags and different things from the theme parks. This one here is $88. Look at the little timer on the back side. You got like Happy Donald, Angry, and then the other one, his hat's flying off his head. But they do have a bunch of the merchandise that is part of this collection, like your Disney Park ears. You have a two different graphics there of Donald on the ears themselves. This one comes with the Sherpa bow, and then the 90th anniversary medallion in the center. Those are really fun design. Those are, let's see here, I do believe $35. Right underneath there is the matching adult size spirit jersey. This is more of like pastel, like blue color. You have Donald throughout the years on the sleeve. Walt Disney World on the back side. And how cool is the huge graphic with Donald Duck? It says since 1934. These are $80. Here's actually something that I haven't seen part of this new 90th anniversary collection. This one is a Disney exclusive, a sepia Donald Duck. Really, really neat. These are $19.99 a piece. That is awesome, though. Like a uh, Walt Disney World exclusive Funko Pop. And here is a 90th anniversary of Donald Duck hat. It has, like, the uh, feathers on the top and his facsimile signature on the opposite side. Those are $30 a piece. And they do still have some of those retro design long sleeves shirts. You have Donald Duck wearing his sunglasses. It says Florida and Walt Disney World for $40. Of course, they do have a very good selection of your different Disney Park lounge flies and matching ears here at Mickey's of Hollywood. This is the brand new shaved ice one. Really, really neat. It's like a snow cone and it's embossed there with that snow cone design. This is really cool, like the ombre color. That one is $88. Right underneath there is the matching pair of ears part of this collection. Actually looks like the snow cone is melting and it has the uh, Disney East badge on the side. I do like how they incorporated the spoon into the bow. That is $40. They had the previous one from the collection. These are the donut ears. Actually looks like the uh, let's see here sprinkles are on there. You have your Disney East badge and I do like how they put the uh, sequence bow. $40 for them and of course they do have the matching Disney Parks lounge fly back back to that one. This is the big zipper compartment right behind the Mickey shaped donut. And then over here, perfect for Halloween time, they have some Tim Burton's Nightmare Before Christmas offerings. Jack Skellington's head is the actual zipper compartment. That's lenticular. A very nice quality simulated leather, though, with zero at the bottom. It has the uh, classic pinstriping. Let's see the old price of Rooney. These are $88 a piece. And then right underneath there, how cool is this um, crossbody bag that they do have with Jack and Sally? This one's actually a Disney Parks lounge fly. Your badge is on the opposite side. Those are $70 a piece. And then perfect here for Disney's Hollywood Studios. They do, of course, have the Mickey and Minnie's Runaway Railway Disney Park Lounge Flies with Mickey, Minnie, you have Pluto, the Sun. These are $78, but the simulated leather is really nice quality. It looks like they're also putting out some brand new baseball caps. This one here is like your corduroy material, just like your football letterman jacket for Monsters University. The cool thing about this one, check out all of the different patches on the backside. Monsters University, Monsters Scares, really neat, very nice attention to detail. That one is $30. They do have your typical Monsters University like weathered baseball caps here as well. That's the embroidered section here with the M and the U. And then it's kind of weathered here on the bottom. That one is $30, and it looks like they do also have a brand new Nike dry fit material baseball cap with the Pixar ball. I really like this design. They are, let's see here, see if we can find the price on the back side, $40 a piece. And with the same design here with Nike and the dry fit material as this one, like a solid white cap just with a, a little embroidered Mickey on the front. And it looks like they are currently running a deal on the adult size graphic t-shirts. Normally $30 each, now $25 each when you buy two. And they are putting out some brand new Halloween ones. Look at this little ghost here wearing the Mickey hat ears. He has his pumpkin. It says my boo and Walt Disney World. This one is incredible. I love that. Right next to there is another brand new Halloween design. This one has like the candy corn colors, your spirit jersey logo with the witch's hat. And then a couple bats peppered throughout. So some really cool designs. 
designs that they do have. Here is another brand new one with Eeyore from Winnie the Pooh. It says gloomy state since 1966. I love his facial expression though, definitely makes the t-shirt. But they do have a couple other brand new uh, graphic shirts here that are part of that deal. This one is chill vibe since 1971 with Mickey, Minnie, actually says Walt Disney World. I like how the palm trees though come together almost to make some ears. And then right underneath there is a really cool a classic Mickey Mouse graphic shirt. It says Mickey Mouse. Then you have like Mickey throughout the years and 1928. And of course you can never go wrong with some 30th anniversary of Disney's Hollywood Studios merchandise. This is an adult sized unisex baseball cap that has the patch there celebrating 35 years with Mickey Mouse and then Disney's Hollywood Studios. That's actually $35, $30. I feel like that's a really good price. Underneath there is the matching Disney Parks lounge fly celebrating 35 years of Disney's Hollywood Studios. You have Mickey, Buzz Lightyear, the Hollywood Tower, Millennium Falcon with all of like the uh, matching gold hardware that's only $78 a few other offerings that they do have part of the 35th anniversary is the really tall corksicle cups. These are $55 a piece, but again, you have Mickey, uh, let's see here, Buzz Lightyear, the Hollywood Tower, and the Millennium Falcon. This is really tall. The backside has your corksicle design. And then right underneath there, they do have some really fun shirts for the kiddos celebrating 35 years at Hollywood Studios with Mickey Mouse for $22. The Disney plushies are always some of my personal favorite items to check out. They are always super duper soft. They have the Bigfoot plushies, but so many different characters. Like look at uh, Pluto's big tootsers here. He has his dog collar on. These are all $35 a piece, but they make so many different characters from Pluto. Right next to Pluto, you have an awesome Grogu plushie. And again, like everything is embroidered, so the best of quality. Right next to uh, Grogu, you have Soli from uh, Monsters, Inc. And down underneath there are even more characters that they do have like so many different offerings. Looks like they even have Chewbacca from Star Wars. And again, perfect for Star Wars Galaxy's Edge. And you can never go wrong with a good solid Donald Duck plushie. Again, $35 a piece for these. You can see how fuzzy they are. Underneath Donald Duck, they also have Winnie the Pooh. And then down here in the bottom section, look at Dumbo the Flying Elephant with his big floppy ears. And now that we've checked out all the newest merchandise over at Mickey's of Hollywood, let's actually head right across the street here to the Celebrity Five and Dime and see what new merchandise we can find over here. Okay, holy moly, as soon as you come inside, you do have the brand new Haunted Mansion collection. There are so many different offerings, like this gargoyle stainless steel cup. It actually has the Haunted Mansion wallpaper on the cup itself. These are $35 a piece. Right next to there is like a whole tree of Haunted Mansion coffee mugs. These are actually like the hot and cold liquids. When you add the hot water to it, the baths show up. Those are $20 each. Let's see what else we could find here, part of this brand new collection. Here's the Haunted Mansion serving bowl set. You do get three different bowls there with the hitchhiking ghost on the inside. In terms of price, those are $55 a piece, but underneath there are the matching Haunted Mansion. These are 50 by 60 inches, the throw blankets. It has a big patch there that's embroidered Haunted Mansion though. These are your weighted throws, super duper heavy. Those are $85 a piece. And it looks like they even have some of your saucer sized dishes. You do get four different designs here with the hitchhiking ghost on the top. Here's a bunch of the different characters though. Those are $40 each. It looks like they're even getting some different kitchen offerings. They have a, a double set of some kitchen towels with the hitchhiking ghost, the Haunted Mansion logo. Logo, but I love the new design that they have this year. These are super duper soft. $28 for the kitchen set. And then right next door, they do also have the matching kitchen apron with the huge pocket embroidered with Haunted Mansion. And it has the same design as the uh, kitchen towels. These don't have prices on them, but they are really nice quality. On the opposite side of the Haunted Mansion rack, though, is even more merchandise. They're even putting out some brand new Christmas ornaments, and this one here actually lights up. It's inside of this, like, almost like a snow globe. That one is $35. Underneath there, though, holy moly, they have so many brand new Christmas ornaments. Look at that. The actual umbrella comes out of the dome glass. That one is $30, but a bunch of different characters that they do have part of this brand new Haunted Mansion logo. They say Haunted Mansion on the backside with the wallpaper. And then last but not least, there are a couple different offerings down here in the bottom section. And again, for $30 a piece. 
And of course, right across the way, perfect to go with all of your Haunted Mansion merchandise. They have a bunch of brand new offerings from Tim Burton's Nightmare Before Christmas. This is the Mayor Throw Pillow, and it's reversible. These are $45 each. I love that brand new design. But underneath there is a 50 by 60 inch brand new throw blanket. This one's not weighted. It's a super soft material. You have Jack Skellington, some spiders, bats, even jack-o'-lanterns. Let's see the old price tag. Those are $45 each. And just like your Haunted Mansion merchandise, they are putting out some brand new Nightmare Before Christmas Christmas ornaments. This one here is a really fun design with Jack Skellington. They are $25 actually, so a couple dollars cheaper compared to the Haunted Mansion ones. This one here is a cool scene with a Sally. You have the jack-o'-lantern. She even has some cats there and a little basket. Let's see who else we have here in the bottom section. Look at this one here. You have Zero inside of the dog bed and it lights up. It has the little dog bowl for Zero. And yet another one here that says Halloween Town. This one lights up as well. And perfect to go with all of the brand new merchandise. How about this new coffee mug that they have from Nightmare Before Christmas. I love the jack-o'-lantern. The backside says the Pumpkin King. This is a great big oversized one for $25. Underneath there, a little bit different. This one's more of like a tall design. You have Jack Skellington Zero. and actually has like the bones there for the handle. Looking for trouble, you have the Mayor, Lock, Shock, and Barrel. This one is a little bit cheaper at $20, but I do want to show you down here how about this you could put your votive candle on the inside and then you have oogie boogie and a bunch of bats flying around this is a heavy ceramic for 35 dollars and I do want to mention they have a couple other brand new throw blankets like this one here from Star Wars Mandalorian. You have Grogu Pepper throughout like inside of his pod, outside of his pod, eating some frogs. These are super duper lightweight and soft. $45 for that one. And then right underneath there is a brand new Monsters Inc. one. This one here is cool to like see the design there with all the different pennants. Really neat. This one is super soft as well for $45. Let's actually check out some of the different coffee mugs here as well. Again, perfect here for Hollywood Studios. You have the really tall uh, caboose here with Mickey and Minnie's Runaway Railway. A nice big oversized one. You have Mickey and Minnie on the opposite side. This one is $25. Right up ahead above that though, how about this really adorable Minnie Mouse one? You can hold on to the mug by the ear or the handle and it comes with the flower uh, stirrer. That one is $25. And that right up ahead is a huge Mickey fist. This one has a huge oversized handle. It's literally, like I said, just a Mickey fist for $25. Some of the other coffee mugs that they do have here. This one is really adorable. From the Muppets, you have Beaker, $24.99. But look at his facial expression he's making. You actually like kind of hold on to his ear for the handle. And then right over here, this one is a really neat design. You have a bunch of butterflies and flowers. Then the backside of there, you have Cinderella Castle. These are $20 a piece, and it's a really good like oversized coffee mug and perfect for Beauty and the Beast. One of my personal favorites is always the Chip coffee mug. He has the authentic little chip here on the side. I love his facial expression though for $25. A few other really awesome drinkware offerings that they do have. This one is an actual lightsaber hilt. It comes with a lanyard that says Star Wars and Darth Vader. Those are only $40 a piece. This is like a rubber section on the bottom side so you can hold it by. It has the little button there where the lid pops up. Right underneath there is another brand new corksicle cup. This one has all the infinity stones. The opposite side here has your corksicle logo. Those are $50 a piece. And they're putting out lots of brand new like Monsters University merchandise lately here at Walt Disney World. This is literally in the shape of a soda can. It says Disney Pixar Monsters University. These are $28 a piece. Let's check out some of the different Magic Band Plus that they have here as well at the Five and Dime. This one is specific to Grumpy Dwarf. You have a big, almost like I etched onto it, Grumpy, and a bunch of small graphics. These are all $45 a piece. This one here has all of the Mickey-shaped balloons with Mickey Mouse on the inside. Really neat though, all the different colors. 
right next to that one is another really fun Mickey Mouse design. You get like Sorcerer Mickey, Dapper Mickey, Mickey Mouse, and Steamboat Willie. This one here is $45. Let's come over here though, because I'm noticing a perfect one for Halloween. You have, uh, let's see here, Jack Skellington and Lock, Shock, and Barrel. I love that design there. And again, really fun for Halloween. Underneath there, though, is a really cool brand new Monsters University one. This has, oh, we almost dropped it. There we go. <laughs> this one has all of the pendants like the blanket that I showed you. $45 for that one. And then right over here are a couple different offerings from Star Wars with the Stormtrooper Galactic Empire. And this one here is specific to Darth Vader. I'm really blown away with all the new merchandise so far. Over here at Mickey's of Hollywood and over at the Five and Dime, it seems like they're really focusing like really hard on all of the Nightmare Before Christmas and Haunted Mansion merchandise and it looks incredible. That being said, let's actually head straight ahead into Keystone Clothiers. They have a great assortment of like different Star Wars merchandise and all sorts of different things. Okay, so as soon as you come inside, they do have those really fancy pullover sweatshirts. The most magical place on earth, Walt Disney World. Since 1971, it has the raised lettering for Walt Disney World. These are $50 a piece, but they have those in a bunch of different colors. Like the really nice hot pink one. They do have the same design there with Walt Disney World. 1971. Right underneath there is a really fun sage color. I feel like that's perfect for fall. And again, continuing the theming with Perfect for Fall, here's a brand new pullover sweatshirt that's embroidered Walt Disney World, most magical place on earth with Cinderella Castle. This is a really nice copper color. Those are $55 a piece. But again, that kind of feels like a Letterman football jacket. And it looks like they are making these in a bunch of different colors, like this green colored one, again, with Cinderella Castle. And they do also have right over here in this section, a burgundy colored one. So a bunch of different ones, just like we saw uh, the other one with Cinderella Castle with the raised lettering for Walt Disney World. And then right over here is a really fun Disney Parks lounge fly with Cinderella Castle. You have Mickey Mouse here in the bottom section. A bunch of fireworks though, even Tinkerbell on the top. You can see like the, uh, let's see here, street lamps on uh, Main Street USA. Then you have the Mickey shaped fireworks. This simulated leather though is very nice quality. These are $78. And they do still have a lot of merchandise specific just to Minnie Mouse, like this Disney Parks lounge fly with the ears. You have Minnie here, like the top half of Mickey, Minnie's head has a big zipper compartment. On the back side here, it also says Minnie Mouse, so very nice attention to detail. Let's see what we got in terms of price. That one is $88. Another really fun pullover sweatshirt. This has Minnie Mouse, like inside of the flowers, making a surprised face. And it says Minnie, kind of like peppered throughout. These are $55 a piece. I do want to show you two other graphic shirts that they do have. This one here says Minnie Mouse, but you have a very sparkly bow. Again, these are adult sizes for $35. This one is really neat as well with Minnie's facsimile signature and a huge oversized bow. Let's check out some of the different pins that they also have here at Keystone Clothiers. So this is the Walt Disney World one with all four beacons of magic, even Tinkerbell. That one is $15. And of course they do have a couple different offerings here for Indiana Jones, one of my favorite shows out of Walt Disney World. This one is $15. And then over here is more of like a classic design I feel with Indiana Jones with his whip. $15 for that. And then over here is a bunch of assorted diamond design uh, Star Wars ones. These are all $12 a piece. You have Princess Leia, R2-D2, one with just Princess Leia, Han Solo and Chewbacca. They do have Yoda, but they have so many different characters with that diamond design. Let's actually spin this around and see what we can find here on the back side. So here's a brand new R2-D2 Magic Band Plus. This one's really well done for $45. Over in this back wall section, there was a bunch of brand new Star Wars merchandise. This is like your football bomber jacket. I love this design though. It's really soft. You have Darth Vader embroidered holding a Death Star balloon, some Star Destroyers, a ton of Stormtroopers. They're even going down the whole sleeve here. This one's a full button down as well. I do want to see if we can find the price. 
The front side here is embroidered Star Wars with the Death Star. These are $90 a piece. Right over here is a really fun, like a crossbody size bag. That's a simulated leather, again, with Darth Vader embroidered holding the Death Star balloon. Those are $30 a piece. Right underneath there, though, perfect for a fancy Disney meal. They do have these button-down shirts. These are as soft as silk. We have Chewbacca. Let's see here. Han Solo frozen in the carbon. R2-D2, Darth Vader, like all of the characters are on there. $65 for that one. Here's a bunch of brand new design Ewok merchandise that I actually don't see everywhere. So it's really cool to see this pullover hoodie. It's embroidered Star Wars. Look at it, it says we. This is awesome. A super soft material. $65 for them. And they do also have an adult size graphic shirt. I love how the characters are actually holding balloons of the different like vehicles and like a Death Star for $40. And tucked away in the back corner is a lot of the merchandise for the 25th anniversary of Star Wars Phantom Menace. Like this huge adult size backpack. This has two pockets on the sides, a big zipper compartment. And this is a Star Wars Herschel collaboration. That one is $90. Right underneath there is a brand new Darth Maul adult size baseball cap. Like this whole design is actually embroidered on there. These are $30 a piece. And one more offering here, part of the Herschel design, is your sling size bag. Very nice attention to detail. The black and red though really pops on there. It has the same patches as the adult size backpack for $70. And they even still do have some of your adult size full zip jackets here for the 25th Star Wars Episode 1 of Phantom Menace. I love the design on the backside. These are actually very heavy as well. $60 a piece for them. And then over here is a trucker hat of Jar Jar Binks. Look at the big floppy ears. His tongue is literally sticking out there on the front side for $30. And it does look like they did restock the Star Wars Galaxy's Edge 5th Anniversary graphic t-shirts. They used to have the pins as well, like all of this sold out. They do have the shirts back in stock for $35. And then right up ahead above them are some huge die-cast Millennium Falcons. It comes in this massive box. Let's see the old price tag. Those are $30 each. Here's even more brand new release Star Wars merchandise like this simulated leather fanny pack. It actually has the snap enclosures. It's embroidered Star Wars 77, R2-D2, even the Darth Vader patch. Together we can rule the galaxy. These are $35. It has another zipper compartment on the top section. They do also have the matching adult size baseball cap. It actually has that same patch there. Together we can rule the galaxy. These are $30 each. And then right underneath there, how about this card again? This is also brand new to Walt Disney World. I want to see what we got doing here. It says, may the force be with you. That's embroidered on the whole side. These are $65 a piece. It's such a nice day to be out and about here at Disney's Hollywood Studios. Let's actually head a little bit further down Sunset Boulevard. We'll check out some of the shops down this direction. And of course, all of the brand new merchandise for the uh, Hollywood Tower Hotel. It is looking incredible over there. I do want to check out all of that as well. Okay, so it does look like there's even more Disney Parks Haunted Mansion merchandise. This is your canvas material. Um, Disney Parks Lounge Flight says Welcome Foolish Mortals. Madame Leota's embroidered on there. The Hatbox Ghost. It even has some beadwork going on. And it's embroidered Haunted Mansion on the side. These are $78 a piece. Right over here is a really fancy women's dress with the Haunted Mansion wallpaper. This one does glow in the dark. I like the neckline though. It's embroidered Haunted Mansion. Those are $70. Let's actually come over here in this direction though because I'm noticing some new merchandise that I haven't seen even over at Disney Springs. This is a really fancy jacket, a full zip. And again, with the Haunted Mansion wallpaper, you do have pockets on the bottom side. Those are $70. And then over here is a whole hurricane candle that does light up. Over here in this section is a brand new pair of Haunted Mansion Crocs, again with the purple wallpaper. These ones actually have the straps, the, uh, straps there on the back side, and it says Haunted Mansion on the inside. Looks like you get six different gibbets there on the front. These do come in adult size. Right over here is a brand new pullover sweatshirt. 
Yeah, Haunted Mansion is getting so much new merchandise here at the Disney theme parks. Let's see if we can find the price on this guy. Let's see what we got doing. So it has that same design here on both sides. These are $60 a piece. And right next to there is the matching spirit jersey, brand new to Haunted Mansion. You do get the raised lettering for Haunted Mansion on the back side. Look at that though, with the hitchhiking ghost. This one does glow in the dark as well. These are $85 a piece. And last but not least for Haunted Mansion merchandise, they do have the green pullover sweatshirt with the gargoyle holding the candles there. This is a very heavy material and soft on the inside for $60. And they do have the matching pair of sweatpants here as well. That's embroidered Haunted Mansion. Then it has the same design going down the pant leg. These are $50, but this whole set is really nice. And they do have a bunch of the merchandise part of the brand new Disney Parks Lily Pulitzer collection like this huge tote bag. It has the gold design here for your Disney Parks badge. These are $148 a piece. You have Mickey and Minnie peppered throughout and a couple big zipper compartments. Right underneath there is some clothing though for the kiddos. Look at this here tank top that they have with two pockets here on the side. You actually have little knots on the side as well. Really nice attention to detail. These are $64 a piece and they do have some women's clothing over in this section like the uh, v-neck graphic t-shirts again you have Cinderella Castle Daisy Duck in there a bunch of palm fronds and flowers for $58 right next to that design those kind of like the matching dress it has the same design here with uh, Minnie Mouse and Daisy Duck for 158 and they still do have a bunch of your Stitch 626 birthday merchandise, like the pullover hoodies. This is that rope design, though. Everything is embroidered from Stitch to the stars and the flowers. These are $60 a piece. Right underneath there, though, is one of my personal favorite Disney Park lounge fly bags. This has all of the black sequins. Definitely really, really shiny. Stitch is on there. The simulated leather, though, is incredible quality. The back side says Stitch 626. Those are 90 eight dollars a piece right next to them is a tie-dye design women's nightgown stitches uh, right here making a winky face you have some almost like waves going on on the sides here on the um on the sleeves those are 48 dollars a piece and they still do have some of your adult size bucket hats for 30 dollars and again you have like stitches claws some flowers some hearts and a patch that's embroidered with stitch let's head right across the street though to sunset club couture and see what merchandise we can find inside so as soon as you come inside, a bunch of your Play in the Park merchandise. One of my favorite tank tops, best vacation ever with Cinderella Castle. It says Walt Disney World, even with the Mickey balloons. This is a very soft material. Underneath there from the Play in the Park collection, they do have the simulated leather uh, wristlets with uh, Mickey and Minnie inside of the teacups. I love Mickey's facial expression, but you have Cinderella Castle, the carousel, even It's a Small World. The beacons of magic are on the backside. Let's see what else we have part of this collection. They have the uh, matching ears with the simulated leather. This comes with a very sparkly bow with almost like a clear sequence. The Mickey hat ears for $35. And then right here is the matching Disney Parks Loungefly backpack. You even get like Haunted Mansion, the Hollywood Tower, even Cinderella Castle and Epcot. So these are perfect to wear over to all four Disney theme parks. $78 for them. But if you look closely, the zipper pull is actually a Disney Park ticket. A few of the other offerings here, part of the Disney Parks Play in the Park collection is this notebook. This is actually filled with liquid and glitter on the front. You can see like the Mickey hat ears and then glitter moving. The back side here says Magic Kingdom, Main Street USA, Adventureland, Frontierland. You have Liberty Square, uh, Fantasyland, and Tomorrowland. Those are $20 each. Right underneath there is the unisex graphic t-shirt. Look at that with the character Characters there riding one of my personal favorite rides Pirates of the Caribbean over at Disney's Magic Kingdom and they do have a couple assorted Christmas ornaments part of the play in the park collection here's a really fun design with Mickey Mouse holding a sparkly Dole Whip this one is $25 my favorite though part of this collection is definitely the goofy one he has his park ticket his autograph book some churros popcorn he has a little bit of everything going on 
They even still do have some of the Hydrangea collection, Disney Parks, Lounge Flies. This has the toned down sequence. The backside is the solid color, like a baby blue. These are $98 a piece. Some of this merchandise has gone to the Disney Character Warehouse part of this collection, so I would definitely expect that will very soon. Here's a brand new adult size graphic shirt that says Walt Disney World. Then you have uh, Minnie Mouse. It almost reminds me of like the 50th anniversary bow. Those are $40 a piece. And then right over here is yet another graphic t-shirt that's brand new. It comes to a little knot on the bottom, but look at uh, Minnie Mouse. It's super duper sparkly for $40. In this back wall section is a bunch of other Disney Park lounge fly bags like your Star Wars Mandalorian Grogu one with all the gold accents. You have Grogu in his pod, outside of his pod, and it comes with the matching gold hardware. This one is $78. This one here I feel like is perfect to wear over to Disney's Animal Kingdom. I love like the leopard print. You have a bunch of hidden Mickeys peppered throughout. And the simulated leather though is just amazing quality. Let's see how much that one is. This one's actually only $78, so a very fair price. And they do still have the rock and roller coaster, uh, Disney Park lounge flies. You can see like the wings, the embroidered roses on the bottom, and it's an actual guitar pick on the zipper pull. A few other brand new offerings to Walt Disney World. This is an absolutely massive fanny pack. You have Scar. Look at Hades, how cool he looks on there. These are actually, let's see here, $40. The backside has this quilted design with the Mickeys for really nice airflow, but the colors on there are really cool. Underneath there is a matching adult size backpack again with all of the assorted Disney villains. It has that same design as the um, crossbody bag that we just saw. I should say the fanny pack we just saw. Those are $50 a piece and they do have some of your adult size Crocs. If you are looking for something that doesn't scream Disney, these actually have instead of the regular holes, they're in the shape of Mickey Mouse for $60. And just like your adult size graphic t-shirts, they are running a deal here on the youth graphic ones. Normally $22 each, now $18 each when you buy two. There's so many different designs, like they have this Winnie the Pooh design, Best Pals, with all of the characters. Right underneath there though is a perfect one for fall. It says Pumpkin Spice, look at that. You have Minnie Mouse and Daisy Duck. It says uh, Pumpkin Spice, everything, and then it says Walt Disney World at the bottom. Let's actually check out some of the other shirts shirts that they do have. So this is more of like a rainbow, rainbow colored design. It says Walt Disney World at the bottom with Cinderella Castle. They're putting out so many cool graphic shirts lately. Underneath there is a bright red one with a retro design with all the characters inside of the squares. We have a Mickey, Minnie, Donald, Daisy, Pluto, and Goofy. A few other designs part of that same deal is this yellow colored graphic shirt with all the characters popping out of the Spirit Jersey logo. It says Walt Disney World. And then right over here is a really cool design. This one just spells out Walt Disney World, but it's actually like a really shiny lettering and you have all the Disney characters peppered throughout. Let's head a little bit further inside Disney's Hollywood Studios over by the Hollywood Tower Hotel and check out the gift shop and all that brand new merchandise that was just released. But holy moly, right now the Hollywood Tower Hotel is currently a 90 minute wait. That is a very, very long wait for this attraction. But the gift shop is actually located here to the back end of the attraction. Even the cast members have such cool costumes. There's some banners here for the Hollywood Tower Hotel. Let's head inside and see what we can find. Okay, so some of the new merchandise is actually as soon as you come inside. Here is a huge coffee mug, the Hollywood Tower Hotel since 1917. Look at the handle, it's the actual key. Those are $19.99 each. Right over here is a huge coffee mug. It actually has the hat that says HTH on the top side. Please don't disturb, you have Mickey Mouse. That is a very heavy ceramic. Lots of different drinkware over here in this section though. It looks like there's even a brand new Tervis tumble. You have Mickey Mouse like shushing. It says Hollywood Tower Hotel, Hollywood, California. And look at Minnie Mouse on the opposite side. These are $35 a piece for the Tervis tumblers. But they even have like the matching hats here. In case you do want to get like full costume, these are really neat. 
but holy moly, even Stitch has a brand new plushie. How cool is this? $26.99 for the brand new Stitch plushie. He is everything though, like I love that. And right underneath there, they have a whole section of some brand new keychains. Again, with Mickey and Minnie, these are the gold tone ones that comes with the key. They are red in color, so I want to say these are $14.99. Even more new merchandise here on this back wall section. So here is a brand new ringer tee. It says Stitch, well, you should say you have Stitch on there. A warm welcome back. Thanks for dropping in. These are $35 a piece. Right over here is a matching pair of Disney Park ears. These are lounge fly with the service elevator, the bow, and then the Hollywood Tower. Very nice attention to detail though. Those are $45 a piece. It looks like there's even some brand new uh, Christmas ornaments here as well. With both sides of the Hollywood Tower, you have Mickey and Minnie on the opposite side. These are $35 a piece. And then right underneath there is a brand new Disney Park Lounge Fly. Again, with the service elevator, the doors do actually open and close. And you have Stitch on the inside. And then the Hollywood Tower Hotel. They are $88. It says thanks for dropping by on the backside. Even over here in this section is a brand new adult size spirit jersey. The backside of this has your raised lettering for Hollywood Tower Hotel. And again, Hollywood, California on the bottom. These are $80 a piece. Let's actually check out the front side though. Okay, so it just has your typical like HTH. That is a really fun new design for a spirit jersey. The cool thing about this gift shop though, you could even get some of your Nightmare Before Christmas merchandise. Like they do have the uh, Sally Spirit jerseys that were just released. The back side says Disney's Tim Burton's The Nightmare Before Christmas. That one is $80. Right over here though, they have the matching Jack Skellington Spirit jerseys as the same design here on the back side with the pinstriping for $80. They have so many cool things though, literally that I haven't seen anywhere else. This is a whole Jack Skellington and doll set limited to 3,700 pieces. You even get like the Santa Claus outfit, zero. And look at the different heads that you get inside there. Like that is really, really cool. It's massive though. It doesn't have the price tag on it. Over here is a bunch of brand new Nightmare Before Christmas merchandise. Like this pair of ears with Jack and Sally. These are actually Disney Park lounge fly. It comes with the remote movable bow. The back side has the mayor and then lock, shock, and barrel. Those are $45 a piece. Right over here is a very fancy, like almost like a sweater, but this one's short sleeve. This will make a cool like Christmas sweater, though it has three buttons. Part of Disney Her Universe with Jack and Sally. Those are $50. Right underneath there is a really cool, um, like almost like a tutu. This is neat though. You have a uh, Jack Skellington embroidered a bunch of times, lots of sequins and different things going on. Those are $60 each. And they even have the brand new Disney Park lounge fly Look at this here with that diamond design. You have Lock, Shock, and Barrel, Jack Skellington, the mayor. Even the zipper pull is an actual bat. Like, how cool is that? This one is, let's see here on the back side, what the old price of Rooney. That one is $78, and the simulated leather is really nice quality. And underneath there, they do have the matching Disney Park uh, Loungefly wallets as well for $50. They have some really awesome new merchandise over at the Hollywood Tower. I love how they incorporated Stitch into some of it. Some of the other merchandise just has like Mickey and Minnie, but you can get a lot of your merchandise as well from Tim Burton's Nightmare Before Christmas there as well. Some different offerings that I literally haven't seen anywhere else here at Walt Disney World. Next up on our Hollywood Studios merch search, let's head on over to Star Wars Galaxy's Edge. Check out all of the new Star Wars merchandise that they have to offer. But I did want to point out, right now Star Tours is only a 15 minute wait. That is not too shabby at all. Right now, Rise of the Resistance is currently an 80 minute wait. So it's a good moment to come out to Galaxy's Edge, check out some of the merchandise and some of the really fun photo ops that they do have. Like this one right over here, like how incredible. Like they have one of the speeders, it actually looks weathered. You can hear the droids, just the sights and sounds in Galaxy's Edge. The 
There is a couple different merchandise booths, though. I do want to show you some of the offerings. Right over here is a uh, kids. Let's see here. This one's a full zip hoodie. Look at that with R2D2, Ray, Chewbacca, BB8. Those are $50 a piece. Underneath there is the T-70. Let's see here. X-Wing diecast vehicle. So they have lots of assorted diecast vehicles. It comes with a little collector's base. Those are $15 a piece. But how about over here? They have the uh, Micro Galaxy Squadron Millennium Falcon Batu. It comes with Chewbacca, Hondo, and some droids. This has the uh, light and sound effects. But some of my favorite items, though, are the assorted helmets that they do have here at Star Wars Galaxy's Edge. Let's see the old price tag on these. They are $60, so not too shabby. And here's a nice fancy women's tank top since my last visit. It has Ray and then BB-8 at the bottom with that nice design though. What definitely makes this one, check out the, like the shoulder pattern. This is almost like a big X pattern. These are $40 a piece. Perfect for a hot day here at Star Wars Galaxy's Edge in Batu. They even have some of the misting fans. These are already filled up, ready to go inside of ice. Look at the uh, straps here. They say Black Spire Outpost. Let's check out some of the happenings on the opposite side of this cart. So here is another uh, graphic t-shirt. This one's almost like a ringer tee, like your Under Armour material with the Millennium Falcon and then Batu. These are $45 a piece. Right over here is another adult size graphic t-shirt. Han Solo, Princess Leia, Luke Skywalker, even Chewbacca on there. I do believe they're $35. They don't have the price tag on them. But underneath here is a resistance throw blanket. Look at the attention to detail. This material is super duper soft. 50 by 60 inches, those are $70 a piece. And I do want to show you one other graphic t-shirt over in this spot. How nice is this? It has the metallic finish where it says Millennium Falcon and the actual Millennium Falcons embroidered for $40. Then the front side of this card is another graphic t-shirt. That's actually like a deconstructed shirt. This has two different colors where it's all sewn in. You have the uh, Starfighter graphic on the bottom. They are $40 a piece. Then here's an oversized coffee mug. I feel like this would be perfect for like a soup mug. Even has two different designs on either side. It says Star Wars Wars Galaxy's Edge at the bottom for $20. Definitely a little bit warm for the weather we're having today, but they do have this long sleeve shirt. This one has four snap buttons on the front. These are $50 a piece, but it's a nice, soft, breathable material. But they even have some of the assorted pins for Star Wars Galaxy's Edge. These are all the open edition ones. That one is $14.99. They have a Bright Suns Batu. Really neat though, like the graphic. This is a big, like, oversized pin. $15 for that one. And they even have the uh, Lanyard Starter Set. This comes with four pins there with Ray, Chewbacca. You get the Lanyard though and the pins for $40. For our first stop, I do want to head over to the toy maker shop and check out some of the assorted plushies that they have. They have so many different characters inside of these baskets. They have the little Jawa plushies. These are $23 a piece, but the attention to detail and the quality of these plushies are amazing. They have a basket here of Darth Vader plushies. Right up ahead is Mandalorian. You can see the cape, like everything is embroidered on here. They do have Kylo Ren and then some First Order Stormtroopers. On the opposite side of the card is your Princess Leia plushies. Just the quality and feel to these. $23 for Princess Leia. Look at the little basket of pork plushies that they have. Really, really neat. Look at their little facial expressions. They even have a basket of Chewbacca plushies. Just like that backpack that we saw, it comes with his crossbody bag. I like how his teeth are embroidered in there. And they even have Ahsoka. They even have a good selection of your posable wooden figurines, like they have, uh, let's see here, Jar Jar Binks, $19.99 for Jar Jar Binks. It says Star Wars Galaxy's Edge on the bottom. They didn't have that one my last visit. Over here is Darth Vader, and again, he's just by himself. He actually has his cape on there as well. That one is $20, but they have a couple different offerings here that have two different characters, like Mandalorian and Grogu. This comes on a much larger base, $25 for that one and then right up ahead is C-3PO and R2-D2 but just like we saw a little bit earlier in today's video like they have a bunch of different die cast figurines here is a huge AT-AT that one is $20 and these are actually really heavy and then underneath there they even have the Millennium Falcon you can see like the size of this compared to my hand that one is $20 as well
And right across the walkway is a huge spot with all the assorted creatures. Like this one is massive. Like the plushies for Star Wars Galaxy's Edge are just incredible. That one is $50. That is Niku. I'm definitely going to butcher some of the different names of the characters, but that one is $50. Let's see what else we got doing here. So I do think you squeeze this one and he makes noises. <laughs> <laughs> That's really cool. $19.99 for the puffer pig. And then over here, they even have, let's see here, some porgs. I do think you can actually, okay, so these are actual puppet porgs. Let's see what we got doing in terms of price. That is $55. Look at the big eyes though. The mouth opens up and then it has the little plastic feet. Like that is adorable. And they even have some of the limited release creature carvings. A good assortment of different characters. They have the uh, Porg there. Let's see here. We have, I do believe this is a Lothcat. $25 a piece for them. But there's lots of creatures like all over the place. This whole place is just surrounded. And always remember to look up because they have different baskets of creatures and lights up ahead. For $60 over in this bottom section, they do have a ton of the monkey lizards. These are actual like shoulder buddies. You can prop them up on your shoulder. It comes with a, a little, let's see if we can pull one out here. One of the little controllers where it's like a little pump, his mouth and his head moves. Those are really neat. And they were actually out of the little plushy keychains my last visit. They do come with a carabiner. These are nice quality, just like the uh, plushies from over at the toy maker shop. They have some porgs. Those are $15 a piece. But a couple different characters. Both offerings, though, are $15. And in, inside of this cage, they do have a loth cat. Look at him there. He has a little porg plushie. He's like snoring. He has some carrots there. Like This is really cool. Like the attention to detail they put into Galaxy's Edge. And then literally right next door is Black Spire Outpost. Here are some adult-sized baseball caps. These are $30 a piece with that really nice design. Even on the back side, like everything is embroidered. Underneath there is a kid's graphic t-shirt specific to Black Spire Outpost. The bottom section says Bright Suns. Those are $25 a piece. Let's head a little further inside though and see what else we can find. So lots of assorted drinkware. This is a, a nice oversized coffee mug. It has two different designs though. It's like etched out. It says Batu. $19.99 for that. And then right over here is another reversible. This one's a toothpick holder. Rising Moon's Batu. And then Bright Sun's Batu on the opposite side. Those are $10 a piece and perfect for the warmer weather here in Central Florida. Another water bottle. This has the twist off lid. I do like the shape and size. Those are $30. Even a perfect way to commemorate your trip here to Star Wars Galaxy's Edge and Black Spire Outpost. This is a very large size 4x6 photo frame with the Millennium Falcon. Those are $35. It's actually made out of solid wood. Right next door is a very generous sized coffee mug that has the Millennium Falcon on the handle. Star Wars Galaxy's Edge at the bottom. Those are $25 a piece. And here is another like collectible figurine for Black Spire Outpost. Really neat though, it's actually the photo op here at Galaxy's Edge with the Millennium Falcon. These are $30. Let's make a little pit stop over here to one of the coolest gift shops at Star Wars Galaxy's Edge, Doc Ondar's, and we'll check out the huge selection of merchandise inside. Okay, so as soon as you come inside, they have even more statues. This is a bust of Yoda's head. These are only $20 a piece. It says Star Wars Galaxy's Edge at the bottom. Let's see what else we got doing over here, though. So here's a little Doc Ondar's Mystery Treasures. It shows you a bunch of the different things you can get on the inside. So it's a little... Uh, mystery box. These are $15. It comes with a plastic case, but they do have them on display so you can actually see some of the different offerings that you can get on the inside. But I do want to show you a really fancy coffee mug. This is one of the coolest ones I've seen yet. I like the shape and size and then the colors work really well for $20. There's so many different lightsabers that they have in this shop though. Like they have the Darth Maul lightsaber. It comes in this really fancy like little containment area. Those don't have the prices on there. But here is another uh, Darth Maul shirt. This one almost comes to a v-neck on the front. But it's a super soft like Nike dry fit material. Those are $45 a piece. Right up ahead is a Darth Maul bust. 
These actually feel like they're made out of coal, like very, very heavy. Those are $20. And they even have some of the Kyber crystal necklaces. Looks like they have the black crystal and then the red crystal. These are $26.99. One of my personal favorite statues, they have Darth Vader's melted helmet. It comes with a display stand. Those are $350. Definitely very, very pricey, but that is so cool. Over here is like a whole Darth Vader Halloween costume for Star Wars Galaxy's Edge, but the quality is definitely there. Like, it's not like your cheaper material. I do want to see if we can find one with the price tag. Okay, so I'm not seeing like the uh, tag sticking out. I don't want to uh, pull on this guy too much, but that is awesome. It comes with everything you need, like the uh, jacket, you get the vest, the helmet, which is a really heavy plastic. And they do have some uh, coffee mugs here. This is a good oversized one. It doesn't have a handle on it, but that's really cool. Those are $25. Even more of the uh, bust that they have with Darth Vader and then Emperor Palpatine. And as soon as you exit Doc Ondar's, one of my personal favorite photo ops in all of Walt Disney World. Right now, this is just incredible. There's not too many people out and about getting their picture taken. You got the Millennium Falcon, all of that too. Smuggler's Run is a 55 minute wait, but a really fun attraction here at Star Wars Galaxy's Edge. That being said, let's continue on our way here at Galaxy's Edge. What else we can find? So as soon as you come inside, they have some first order stormtrooper helmets. These are the uh, voice changing masks with authentic sounds and phrases. They are $29.99 a piece. Those are really cool. Over here is the matching binoculars part of the set. These actually open up to a really good size. Those are $30 a piece. And then right underneath there is the baton and shield set. They pop open with the light and sound effects. So here's another brand new adult size graphic t-shirt again with Darth Vader on the pocket. It says finish what they couldn't. These are $40 a piece in the adult size. And again with Darth Vader, they do have the, uh, let's see here, Disney Park lounge flies. This is all embroidered, the simulated leather, and it glows in the dark. You have your Star Wars lounge fly badge on the side. Those are $88. And here's some little uh, banners. These are perfect for like an office desk. It says loyal to the Empire. Empire. It comes with a little stand as well. Those are $20. And then right underneath there is another kid size t-shirt. This one is brand new with Darth Vader's helmet. I like the split color. These are $32. In this section here is even more drinkware. This is a nice size uh, stainless steel cup. Very nice attention to detail. Those are $30 a piece. And here's a brand new coffee mug for the 709 Legion. This one is really tall. It says strength through, let's see here, order on the inside. Really neat though. These are $20 and yet another coffee mug on the bottom section. Look at the handle, loyal to the empire. And then on the opposite side, these are $19.99. I like that, that's really creative though with the handle. Underneath here is a uh, set of binders with uh, light effects. This is actually has the foam on the inside, so it definitely won't hurt. Those are $19.99. And here's an adult size tank top that's also new. This one's really nice as well, $40. Perfect for the warmer weather in Central Florida. The backside says loyal to the empire. This is a very soft, thin material. I do also want to show you some of the different refrigerator magnets that they have. This is the Star Wars Rise of the Resistance with all the AT-ATs. These are red in color, so $12.99 for them. Then they have the enlisted A1s with Darth Vader. Let's make a little pit stop and head inside Droid Depot here at Star Wars Galaxy's Edge. A bunch of really fun merchandise and they have a bunch of droids on display. A really cool photo op before you even head inside of the store. Okay, so as soon as you come in size, an adult size up t-shirt. This one says Droid Depot. You can see like the outline of R2-D2. It says uh, Black Spire Outpost on the sleeve. These are $37. Over here is a Droid Builders adult size baseball cap. It even has a little pocket on the top. Really neat though. Like that's really unique. It says Droid Depot on the backside. $35 for them. And then right over here is a very breathable material baseball cap. Industrial Auto 
Dalmatian. Has a little patch on the front for Droid Depot. Let's see how much that guy is. $29.99 for them. And then right over here is an adult size. Let's see, this one's a pullover hoodie. It has R2-D2 on the backside. These are $60. I do want to see what's going on with the front. It has the R-Series R2 droid. And that has a little patch at the bottom for Droid Depot. Really cool. Of course, they do have a good selection of different kitchen items. This is a very heavy stainless steel. This would be great for like a chips if you're doing like a party with R2-D2. Those are $75 a piece, but that's a really good size. Another cool coffee mug. This is two droids stacked on top of each other. It has the huge uh, handle. Those are $27.99. And then right underneath there is a matching salt and pepper shaker set for Droid Depot. They come together to make one. So if you're looking for something that saves a little bit of space, those are $20 a piece. Then here's some glassware that I haven't seen before here. This one has the R2 series, just like we saw on that pullover hoodie. And then Droid Depot at the bottom for $15. Here's a kid's graphic t-shirt as well. It says, Galaxy's Most Wanted Droid Friends Forever. It has all of the droids at the bottom, and then you have the Droid Depot patch on the sleeve. These are $32 a piece. Underneath there are even more refrigerator magnets. This is the BB Series Builder um, magnet. That is $14.99, and they even have some Batu ones, or I should say Babu. Yeah, Babu Frick. Pebu Frick, suspected droid hacker. That one's only $10. They even have some R2-D2 crossbody bags. These are actual Disney Park lounge fly. You can see here how it comes with the strap and this bag lights up. Those are $75 a piece. The, assim the simulated leather, very nice quality. Here's an adult size t-shirt. You have the R2-D2 Star Wars Astromech Droid, another soft material. Those are $40 a piece. And then underneath there is a sensory friendly R2-D2 graphic shirt. It says the cute one. That is $27. This is my personal favorite thing about being inside of Droid Depot. You can see all the different droid pieces. They have whole droids, like mounds upon mounds of them. A really fun photo op if you did want to get your picture taken. Or of course, you can build your own droid. Like you can see like the top of R2-D2, the top of BB-8, all of the different pieces come through on these conveyor belts and you can build your own droid. Some of the other merchandise offerings that they have. This is a kid's tank top. Sales, service, trades. You have BB-8. And look at this. There's like a little carabiner at the bottom with a pocket. This is a kid's one for $32. Underneath there you have the R2-D2 metal dome. This is actually super duper heavy. How cool is that though? It lights up and works with a Droid Depot R unit. Those are $30 a piece. And then even more of the mystery crates that they do have. These are the Droid Factory ones. You get a single Droid action figure on the inside. Now these don't have the prices, but I do believe they're $15. But you can see on the display all of the different droids you can get. I had such a fun time today hanging out here at Disney's Hollywood Studios, checking out all of the newest merchandise that Walt Disney World has to offer. Lots and lots of brand new Halloween type merchandise from Haunted Mansion, Tim Burton's Nightmare Before Christmas, as well as all that brand new merchandise from the Hollywood Tower Hotel. Really cool stuff going on here lately, even all around all of the Disney theme parks. But again, if you are interested in any of the merchandise in today's video, definitely check out the shopping tier of our Patreon page. I'll add a link to that in the description box. But if you like today's video, give it a big thumbs up. And as always, make today awesome.